everyone here is Trooper L and this is going to be a tutorial about using Bluestacks yes Bluestacks Android on PC the way you can record your Castle Clash videos and upload them on YouTube or share with your friends in private what is it? ADW Launcher And here you go! Hey man, how you did it? It looks awesome and it's just a just like a Android view. Yes, this is a basic uh, custom uh, custom Bluestacks view and I don't think so it's looking good and it's useful but here we've got this launcher that looks pretty good is very fast can handle a lot of shortcuts and uh, some widgets so I've got here a lot of settings first normal bluestack settings then uh, another settings uh, here are Google settings here we've got dev settings for some programmers and guys that know how to use them mm, running processes so it's very useful I think so I'm going to figure out how it can help me to improve performance of Bluestacks and also app settings so uh, if it should be as a tablet view or default uh, also I've got a widget widget of clock from Xperia this is my favorite because my cell phone has Xperia SP so I really like it mm. what else we've got one mobile this is a custom app actually this is a uh, app store uh, why we should use it because when we are when we are using uh, my tab joy to get some gems um, via uh, for caster clash uh, when there are some apps that we cannot download from Google Play yes so then uh, we are a lot of tabjoy offers yet so mm, then we are just simply uh, downloading them via one mobile don't forget to do not update one mobile because uh, the latest version do not allow us to download they are redirecting us to google play and it's not good what else? Everything from the settings here we've got Game Pop Home. This is a custom uh, menu for Bluestacks. We've got here widget with some mm, settings like Wi Fi, Bluetooth, uh, localization, synchronization, and brightness, but it's not working. It depends on your PC screen brightness. Here we've got how we can customize uh, this, mm, this 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 launcher. We can resize it, make it wider, or just leave it as it is. Uh, what else we can do? We can arrange screens. We can add, I think, up to five or even seven screens but I don't need so many of them mm, three of them is enough or even one uh, what else we can blockade our screen we can change background we can do everything what we even want 
a lot of settings everything what we want we can do it yes uh, we can also add widgets shortcuts some actions uh, folders so um, how to find it go to google play and search ADW ADW launcher here we've got it uh, it's not a big file just a few gigabytes I think so oh uh, gigabytes I mean uh, megabytes two and then two and a half megabyte that's not so much we have a lot of other also launchers terms that we can use okay so now let's turn on cast the class oh also some other things uh, during creating on Castle Clash we can turn on something like this that will appear in few seconds because Castle Clash is uh, oh you can see this frames per second how many more read and write and foul sync. Read and write, this is uh, how many memory, uh, RAM memory is your uh, blue stacks reading and writing. Uh, foul sync means that uh, I've got a frames per second blockade um, on 60, 60 frames per second max. Why only 60? Because uh, my screen has uh, refreshing time 60 Hertz and some other screens can even have 120 or even more so um, they ha they will have higher blockade uh, what we can do also walk we can zoom and zoom in and zoom out I saw a lot of players asking how to do that you have just to click control and scroll your mouse uh, when you do not hold control you can scroll and it's going to move up and down but it's not so useful I think and how to turn on this thing at the bottom of your screen you have to click ALT and O I think that this is uh, very useful uh, and I haven't seen yet anyone using this what else we can do we can set alarm on current hour we want we can search some apps cast the clash or we can use app finder there we've got amazon we've got android and one mobile market big choice big choices uh, from among these three to choose mm, we can of course install a browser and search internet uh, here we've got all apps uh, app sync we've got also cloud but I cannot find it now where is cloud it is probably this cloud app sync I'm not using this I don't like clouds but uh, but okay Mm, so I think that's going to be all for uh, for this tutorial about the blue stacks or maybe no yeah, also a few other things to it okay we are again on my home screen and this is shortcut cast to clash how to use this shortcut how to edit 
Go to your menu start, type Castle Clash and it's going to search Castle Clash. Is it set? Just wait a few seconds. Faster PC is going to find it faster, of course. And here we've got Castle Clash and just drag it on your main page screen. Uh, I noticed that it might not work always. Um, if it's not working to you and you turn it on, click double click. You have to go into settings and uh, and third, 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 third tab. And you have to uh, click on run as a administrator. Uh, something else what can do? You can go to reg edit. Uh, thing that improve your Bluestacks performance. Go to run, turn turn on run. Uh, type reg edit. Click OK. Yes. Uh, and here we've got few few windows few folders. You have to open uh, HKEY local machine uh, open then software then open Bluestacks and then you have to open uh, which one? which one? wait wait Guest? yes Guest and under click on Android and here we've got memory. Double click, change to uh, 10 binary system. And here we've got memory RAM usage maximum for your blue stacks. Um, I think that custom one is 500, uh, and you can increase it. And the recommended amount of RAM for blue stacks, a maximum that you can put is half of your total uh, RAM on your PC. I've got four gigabytes, so I typed two gigabytes for blue stacks. Of course, you can uh, uh, write less than half of total amount of RAM. Uh, but I have a lot of lags due to low performance of Bluestacks, so I put uh, maximum amount of uh, RAM to Bluestacks, yes. The difference is not so big as it should be, but we can see less lags and um, Bluestacks running faster than normally. So, so, I think that's everything for today. If you like this tutorial, just like my video, write comments, subscribe, share my videos with friends, guildmates and other people that you know and help me to grow my channel as fast as it's possible. Thanks for watching and see you in the next videos.